praise you, Father, for working miracles. Miracles have not ceased. For, Lord, you are the same yesterday, today, and forever. And I thank you, Father, for manifesting yourself, manifesting your power, Father, today. The power of the Lord that is present here to heal, Father, to bind up the brokenhearted, the power of God that can set the captives free, Lord Jesus, to bring deliverance to the captives. Thank you, Lord. We receive it, Father. How you anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power. And he went around doing good, healing all that were oppressed of the devil, for God was with him. And now, Father, you have put us here on this earth. The same Holy Spirit that was in Jesus lives in us, so we can go around doing the same thing, healing all those who are oppressed of the devil, because God is with us. And that makes all the difference, Father, that you are with us, so this is not our own power. It is a power that you give us out of weakness that we can be made strong, Father. The grace that you give us is sufficient for us. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Father. We believe, Lord, right now that this is an active power working in us to bring strength into bodies, Lord. Healing the sick, Father. Even through these cameras, Lord, I thank you. Lord, let the words go into your people and heal their bodies, Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for moving with mighty signs and wonders. Hallelujah, in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. Let's sing about this power that God has given us. Jesus said, He that believes on me shall do greater works than these. And the reason we can do the greater things is because that same power that was in Jesus now lives in us. This is not a power that has died or ceased. This is the same power that 2,000 years later is still effective. It is able to heal bodies, bring back organs in line, and set the captives free. And that's what we're going to start singing about, the miracle working power. It's not only about Jesus having that power. If you are a son of God, you got this power. The Bible says that as many as received him to them, he gave the power to become the sons of God. You are a son of God and you've got miracle working power in your hands. Hallelujah. Just lift up your hands and say, Thank you, Lord, for miracle working power in my hands. Hallelujah. Just say, Thank you, Lord. These hands have miracle working power. The power of Jesus works through my hands. Works through my hands. I can lay hands on the sick. I can lay hands on the sick. And they shall recover. And they shall recover. Bring yes. deliverance to the captives. Bring deliverance to the captives. Because the power of God. Because the power of God. Works through my hands. Works through my hands. Hallelujah. Praise God. And all of you joining us online, sing along with the lyrics on the screen as we declare about the miracle working power that lives in us. This power can it can heal your physical body. It can bring deliverance to you, whatever it is you need, nothing is impossible with our God that we serve. So join us as we declare about the power He has given us. Amen. Let's rejoice.
dangerous now Straight and stride to stop us But the church of Jesus
matter that we wear the garment of sadness well you're going to lose your energy lose your strength and get weaker and weaker but the more you wear the garment of praise the stronger you're going to get you're going to see how out of weakness you will be made strong i always see many times in scriptures he always talks about people coming out of weakness and were made strong even paul said that god's grace is sufficient for us his strength is perfect in weakness so if you are in a weak state today maybe weakness in your mind and in your thoughts or weakness in your body take this promise and say lord your grace is sufficient for me your strength is perfected in my weakness we got to magnify the strength of the lord as you read the psalms so you see you know david says the lord is my strength many times he repeats that lord you are my strength because you know we have a physical strength in our body that if we depend on that we are limited but if you depend on the lord he gives you strength beyond what you can feel in your body that's the strength he gives you you know when you see in the scripture the the story about how this man he was seated at the gate he was begging and when he saw paul or peter and john he looked at them with expectation expecting to receive just some money but paul peter said silver and gold have i none but such as i have give i thee in the name of jesus rise up and the scripture says that his feet and ankle bones received strength and he he didn't just stand up it says he leaped up and he walked that's what the strength of god can do for you it can strengthen areas that are dead in your life maybe areas that maybe it could be dead deadness in your marriage or dead in you know relationships or finances go to the word of god and get your strength as you strengthen yourself in the lord the lord can raise up what is dead that's what he's able to do out of what is dead he can bring it to life but you got to speak words out of your mouth you got to speak life mm-hmm. it's easy to talk the dead situation but according to the word we see let the weak say not i am weak but that i am strong speak what god says it's not a lie when you talk the word you're not speaking a lie it's the truth that can set you free it's the truth that can bring life what natural circumstances cannot do there is limitations nothing is impossible with god when you speak what his word says hallelujah you can be made strong that's what we're going to sing in this next song i believe i receive it's mine this song starts like that when you pray that's the moment you believe that you receive it jesus looked at people and he always said your faith made you whole the lady with the issue of blood when she heard about jesus she said within herself if i may touch his clothes i will be whole her faith brought her the results she believed it before she saw the result and she said it let's choose to believe it without just walking by what we see in the natural but the word can change your circumstances when you hold fast to it let's sing about it believe that you receive your healing or whatever it is while you're singing this just name that situation that you're believing to change whatever area it might be say lord i believe i receive that it's mine i believe that i have restoration in my relationships i'm taking your word i believe for restoration in my body restoration in my finances as we sing it just name that what you believe for and you receive it
to sick bodies flow into the lives of people right now and bring healing, restoration, and help in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. You can do what you couldn't do right now because there's healing power here. Let's say that again. It's working. Oh, it's working. away far away from us thank you Jesus you don't have to go to the grave believing the lies of the devil that you need to go through this sickness and that sickness and what the world believes they may say at this stage you get this kind of sickness you might get you know this kind of thing in your body it just happens that's a lie from the devil you can go believing as you age you can get stronger day by day stronger in the Lord in the scripture, it tells us about Caleb. When Moses appointed Caleb and Joshua, Caleb says in that verse, he's talking after 40 years. So when Moses called him, he was 40. And he was saying, maybe somewhere in his 40s, but he was, in that verse, when he's about 85, he said, yet I am as strong this day as I was in the day when Moses called me. He was saying at 85 years, he said, I'm still strong this day. He didn't talk about his feeble or feebleness of body or weakness. He said, I'm strong this day as I was in that day. That can be your confession of faith. Lord, I'm getting stronger day by day. Not weaker day by day. I'm getting stronger. And it's not your strength. It's the strength of the Lord. Let's declare that together. Let's say, I am strong this day. More than, I ever have been More than I have ever been before, before. because the Lord, is my strength, the Lord is my strength and I am being renewed, I am being renewed. Day, by day. day by day. I'm getting stronger, I'm getting stronger. In, my mind, in my mind, in my physical body. In my physical body. I am strong in, the Lord, strong in the Lord and in the power of His might. Of his might. No, more weaker, no more weaker, no more talking about the sickness. Lord I, magnify you. Lord, I magnify you. You are the God, are the God that heals me, that heals me restores me restores back, me. To life again. back to life again. In Jesus' name. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah.